Hey guys, so uh, this is the second reptile I got um, this week. I just did a video on my first reptile that I showed. Um, as you guys can read, and I always feel like I can surprise you guys, but then I, obviously I can't because you can read the titles. Um, unless if it's a very general title. Um, there we go. Get that little towel off them. Um, this is my new Siamese um, Mex uh, Mexican American Red Ear Slider. If you can tell, this one's probably a Mexican. Whoa, feisty. Um, yeah, that small one actually tried to just turn around and nip me just now. Um, if you guys can see, this Siamese. It's obviously Siamese because, well, not only can you tell their body is split, if I could show you their underbelly. Oh, come on. Their arms and legs are pretty strong, pushing. There we go. You can see the underbelly, Siamese. You can, can see there are four arms and two legs. So in total, they actually have six legs. There we go. Yep, in total, they have six legs. The back legs kind of just, you know, swinging around in the midair. They're actually mostly using their upper body to crawl around everywhere. And, um, oops. Um, as you can tell, one of them is definitely more dominant than the other. Um, if I could show you the top view of their shell. And hold them nicely because they're very small and fragile. Um, if you can see the top view of their shell, that is actually, see there's a smaller one that sticks out on the side and then there's the more dominant one. And um, yep, the more dominant one is definitely this one as you can tell. And then that one's just kind of crawling on the side trying to get somewhere sometimes. Um, yes, they do normally go in circles because uh, they can't really get anywhere since the other person's dragging them. Um, as you can tell right now, the dominant one's actually moving around the most. Um, and uh, I did a video before on uh, my two-headed American, Mexican, I, I'm not sure which type, some people said American, so whatever. Um, I guess it is. But anyways, red ear slider, either way. Uh, a two-headed red ear slider. And um, basically what happened with that one was um, I was actually, uh, I was going to get by it, but then I, during that time I was actually just taking care of it because it was a shop animal. Um, but then, you know, somebody wanted to buy it really badly, so then I said, you know what, go ahead, buy it. And that person had quite a lot, two headed, so, so I let him get it. This time, again, this one is the one, uh, this is one that I actually bought now. and. Um, so I'll be keeping this guy permanently. Um, as you guys know, I don't. I'm not really into turtles. I don't. I hardly ever have any turtles. Anyways, um, I care for. Mo I care for them at the shop. I do help sometimes, but um, obviously, it's not my strength in reptiles. Uh, I would definitely be caring for snakes and lizards um, before I care anything for turtles. But sometimes changing waters or feeding them. I definitely do help out when they're a bit busy. Um, but anyways, that was different. That was a two-headed one. This one is a Siamese. And um, their bodies are actually quite equally split. So it is quite a chance for them to survive. Obviously, there's one smaller than the other. But the smaller ones, um, you can even tell. I showed you the view of their underbelly. You can tell there's definitely enough space for all his organs to be there and uh, as you can tell right now as well they're actually quite active um, that small one right there is actually clawing down onto my hand while the other one's just dragging him away and sometimes he does push around himself um, another thing to tell that they're actually healthy is that both heads eat so both of them would eat in their little pellets and fish meal and uh, crickets, whatever they eat. So yeah guys, this is my new uh, Siamese Mexican Ritter slider. And um, I should put them back into the water before they get too dry. But yeah, I uh, just wanted to show you guys this cool little guy. And also, um, just so you guys are wondering, I actually named them uh, 
Tom and Jerry. Obviously, if any of you guys know the cartoon Tom and Jerry, the big one would be Tom, and the small one would be Jerry. Did you just see that? Did you just see that? Oh, there we go. There we go. They're having a fight on which direction to go. And currently, Jerry's actually winning. You go. You go, boy. You go. Um, so, yeah, guys, if you guys have any more questions, requests, um, please comment or inbox me, and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. Bye-bye.